All right, so I'm still working my sources regarding the commanders, and here's what I'm just finding out. The commanders will interview quarterbacks coach Ken Zampezi for the offensive coordinator position. The team fired their previous OC, Scott Turner, yesterday. Now, Zampezi has experience calling plays, but my source also says it's still very likely the team will hire a new OC from outside the building. For more on the commanders, here's Charlotte McBride. Well, by now, we've all seen this heartwarming video of Washington Commanders special teams player and safety Jeremy Reeves finding out he would be going to the Pro Bowl. He was emotional because the road to success has been a rocky one for Reeves. But now he's recognized as one of the top special teams players in the league, and today his colleagues voted him as a member of the Players All-Pro team. He's the only Commanders player selected. I think the coolest, you know, Part of it is like the guys that I compete against every Sunday voted for me and it wasn't my teammates, so it wasn't any bias. This is people from every team. This is the first year the NFL has decided to select its own all pro team. As Jeremy mentioned, it's voted on by all players across the league and he doesn't take these personal accolades lightly. At one point, I was somebody that like was fighting just to stay in the league. You know, and like clawing, scratching away, just trying to stay in the door. It just goes to show like your life can change in a year. You know, everything can change in a year. This time last year, Reeves wasn't sure what his future in the NFL looked like, but he never lost faith. Undrafted in 2018, this is the first year he made the initial 53-man roster, having been cut four times in five seasons before his breakout season this year. I had to go through my season of waiting to, um, to get to where I am today. And so <clears throat> just to continue to you know keep the faith in yourself and continue to believe in God and and that he's working in your life and that you're not alone on your journey. Next up for Reeves, heading home to Pensacola, Florida tomorrow and then begin training for the Pro Bowl on February 5th. You know, just continue to work and to continue to believe in yourself and, um, you know, speak life over yourself and, you know, great things follow. Jeremy is a free agent and says he doesn't know what 2023 looks like, but he loves Washington, loves this community and hopes to be a commander moving forward. All right, good stuff, Charlotte. Time for my last call. American University may be the best men's college basketball team in Washington, D.C. The Eagles have won 12 of their last 13 games. They're undefeated in Patriot League play, beat George Washington, beat Georgetown, which was their first win over the Hoyas in 40 years. And what makes their success even more impressive? AU really struggled last season, only five conference wins. An American win over Army tonight will match last season's conference wins total. Yeah, and we still have 13 more league games to go. That's my last call. They did a little reset after last season, came back strong. Very strong. <laughs> Thank you, D. We'll be right back.